Abilene's Local News at 6. Welcome back. It's now time for our weekly Do My Job segment. It's uh, Scott Cook. You know, he heads out of the Weather Center. Yep. And he goes to try his hand at someone else's job. Right, and this week Scott got in touch with his artsy side at Studio 13. See what brush strokes he perfected. Most of the time working at KRBC, I'm using the left side of my brain, crunching numbers and creating a weather forecast. But this week, Studio 13 gave me the chance to be a bit more creative. When you're painting, be free. Don't get up tight. Just do your thing. Being my first time in an art studio, I was drawing a blank on what it was I should create. But it was nice to know that I wasn't alone. <laughs> we, we sometimes have an uh, artist block, and we don't even know what to paint. And so having a lot of artists around each other, this is what inspires us. And we start thinking, and then we go, oh, you know, I'd love to paint this or paint that. Wanting to take advantage of the art community, I decided to see all the different ways that I could express myself. A micro mosaic is a picture made of thousands of tiny pieces of glass. I take the strings of glass and cut them up, and I only use the ends of it to create the picture. Uh, if you want to get into uh, sculpture, I would recommend starting small. Generally, needs to be able to look good in the round so that you can. You know, you can walk around it, you can look at it from different angles. This is a pastel. It's a different medium. It's a, it's a pigment which is in solid form, but it's very vibrant. It's a very vibrant color. After talking with everyone, I discovered there were so many different mediums of expressing oneself through art. So I decided to ask for a little help on what I should do. Since uh, you've seen all the work that's been uh, going on and the different styles of art, what we're going to do today, we're going to set you up with uh, Bruce Hackney. He is a uh, landscape artist, and he's going to let you get in there and start painting on that painting. You're going to get to paint on his canvas. Finally, it was time to put brush to canvas, and since this piece looked mostly finished, I was tasked with adding some of the finishing touches. With careful instruction, I put some of the highlights into the tree. Feeling like I was an accomplished artist, I decided it was time to head back to KRBC. You never are through, you just quit. <laughs> but that's probably true. Doing your job around the community, I'm artist Scott Cook, KRBC News. Excellent. Yeah, yeah I like thank that. you, Scott. And if you'd like Scott to try your job, you can email him at scook at krbc.tv. Up next on your local news at 6, David.